Hello my friend and welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to do a plaid mani for my friend Omnia. I started off with Neltik's Formula 2 and I'll be using Color Club Lady Holiday as my base color. And this is a really old one. I don't know that I've ever used it. This was one that I got when they had that crazy 99 cent sale out on the internet and um, it, I got so many at once that I really don't remember ever using this one. And at first I was kind of disappointed, but I started noticing it was leveling out really beautifully. And after the second coat, it was perfect. So big surprise, happy surprise. Hi Woody, how you doing? So I'm gonna go in with the second coat and it's gonna smooth it all out. And it's just, it turned out to be a beautiful light gray polish beautiful so it's going to be perfect for this plaid manicure that I'm fixing to do yep that's a southern thing fixing I'm fixing to do it so we're going to top it with some pro fx quick dry top coat and get it to dry down before we do some stamping so today I'm going to show two ways to do a two colored plaid mani if you only have one plaid image on a plate I'll be using Beauty Big Bang XL, oh gush, 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 oh I don't remember, 062, and I'll be using my Braves Diva Black Stampin' Polish and that Beauty Bang Metallic Hollow, no it's not metallic, it's hollow red. I think it's just a regular polish, but I'm going to use it for stamping today. So on this first one, I'm out of frame. I do stamp it in the red hollow first clean off my stamper and my plate with some pure acetone and then I'm going to go in with the black same image and I'm going to pick it up and then I'm going to turn the stamper around so that I'm getting the different angle of that same image and plop that rascal on there and there you go I'm going to show this again on my pinky so don't don't worry I'll, I will be showing it the next style of doing this is where you just put drops of the different colors in, in the row, you know, kind of cattywamping them, and then scrape, one good scrape, and then pick up, and then stamp it just like that. So if you only have one plaid image on a plate, you can do the double or even triple colors. You just let your mind go crazy. Now this plate did have two images on it, but I wanted to show you all out there, if you've only got one, you can still do this look. You can still rock it. Just pick a way that you like doing it and do it. <laughs> so this is the same as my middle finger, and those two are gonna match. And then my pinky, I'm gonna go in with the red again scrape. I'm going to pick up and put that down on that pinky nail. I'm almost out of frame, but at least you can see it. And then now I'm going to go in with black. Same image, same everything. And here we go. I'm going to turn it around and then kind of line it up and stamp it down. So there you go. I am going to go in with a piece of tape and do a little bit of cleanup on my nails. Most of it came up really well, so now I'm going to go in with my cleanup brush and some acetone. You can use regular nail polish for this step if you like. Or you can do the college girl hack and just wait until you get in the shower. That's what my niece taught me. So I am going to cover it with this smudge free top coat. Get it to dry down real well. And then I'm going to top it with posh. And we're going to seal this plaid design in and rock it through the week. Perfect, perfect manicure for this time of year. It has been nasty wet and cold here, so I was ready for some flannel looking, plaid flannel looking nails. So I do have some polish in motion here and then a swatch photo. I wanna thank my friend Omnia. I will have a link for her channel down below for requesting this. And I wanna thank you all for watching and until next time, be good to yourself.